What's up YouTube? It's your boy Lopes and welcome to the new car. So this is my 2018 Civic Si sedan. This is what comes in the K-Tuner box. So open her up, Vanna White. OBD2 cable. Yeah. USB cable. Mm -hmm. uh, the mounting bracket on the back, but it doesn't come with the... Any type of mounting for it. Yeah. I thought it came with some type of mounting gear here, but it does not. And then you got your... Your Mac Daddy himself. Nice. Fancy. And that's pretty much you it. Got your little screen. So the flash has worked. Time to turn on the car. And uh, let's see how she feels. The car doesn't even have 400 kilometers yet, and it's flashed. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be sick. Let's go. All right, guys. First gear, 4,000. feels pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. It's, it feels a lot peppier. Uh, what is the most JDM thing you can do to any car? Uh, Alex, what's the most JDM thing? Mods. JDM emblems. So we got the red JDM emblems for the front, the back, and the steering wheel. So it's gonna be a small video on how to install it. So Alex just wants to break it off. I think there's screws in the back of the grill. And he's just... I'm sorry. <laughs> this is just breaking it off. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, buddy. Oh yeah, do it for dummies. Okay, dummy number one. <laughs> Placing the holes, there's tape, press her down. It's like your cheap type R, basically. When you can't afford a type R, what'd you do? I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying to make videos here. And this guy it's always. It's okay, it's okay. We're good, we're good. Today, we're installing clear JDM side markers because the red JDM emblems were just not enough. Alex is now plugging in the light, and we're gonna test if it works, and hopefully, it does because we spliced it. So, you're gonna have two settings where you're gonna turn it on, it's gonna just be white, and then when you signal, it should be orange because I believe those are the ones I bought. I'm very new to this. I got the car Tuesday. As you guys can see, they're LED ambers, which is kind of cool, a little different. I think they complement the car a lot more. It's a lot better. Looks super, super clean. Today we are installing a Type R lip on my 10th gen SI. It's a 2018 SI sedan, and we're installing the Type R lip. It's a legit Slow one from induction. Honda. That's what the SI stands for. Slow induction. <laughs>
looks amazing. And welcome back to another video. Today's a fun video. We are going to do something kind of simple. Uh, it's a very small part, but it's supposed to help quite a bit. We are doing the acuity, 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 acuity. acuity. We're doing a acuity. We're doing a acuity short shifter adapter on my 2018 Honda Civic Si. So the product looks like a pretty solid product. Looks like it's designed quite well. Product. 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 It's solid metal, which is nice. It should slide right up into it. So you lube that up so you can pop that back in there. Look at you. <laughs> yo, did you just get, <laughs> yo, did you get lube on your face? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Wouldn't be a first time, would it? When that is on, so just describe how you feel compared to it was before. at the car what do you guys think I did by just looking at it guess hmm I wonder what's been eliminated a lot of that wheel gap that's what today is something very simple I hope I don't regret it I bought stuff off eBay I don't know we'll see how it goes but let's get into it. Look at this. You guys ready? Look, look, boom. So if you guys don't know what this is, you probably do because of the title of the video actually. <laughs> so this is the Type R window visor. I bought off eBay. I like it because it matches the color of the car. So it kind of flows. It gives it a bit of an aggressive touch. Once again, the Fitman, I would say nine and a half out of 10. It's the Civic Type R shifter assembly. And for once, this is a change. Alex is behind the camera and I'm the one doing the work, right guys? Oh, we got a clear path in Mexico here. And we'll do a little rip. Let's settle down. All right. So, were you ripping it or? What? Were you ripping it? Yes. Oh, okay. Funny guy behind the camera suddenly, huh? I kind of messed up. So, I had the OEM SI wheels, which were not bad, and I traded for another set of wheels that you're gonna see shortly for the 2018 Civic SI. I agreed to the trade. As I put them on, I didn't like them. So what we're gonna do is show you how they look and I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna fix it. So here they are. So, as you guys can see, these are the wheels. 18 by eight plus 38 and they're type R lookalike wheels. I wasn't a fan of the pinstripe around, I was gonna paint them, but I came up with a plan, what I can do. Don't mind the garbage. Came up with a plan. They're not horrible wheels, they're nice looking wheels, right? But just not my style. I like the spoke wheel, I just don't like the pinstripe. So, as you can see, we're on blocks because I needed to raise the car. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take these wheels off and we're gonna put the RPF ones on here. Mm -hmm. Check. Oh, right in the puddle. Oh, no. Good ass handles. See, I'm distracted by the fire. Check that out, look how good that looks. I thought the wheels looked too small, but because the tires are thick and meaty, it actually looks pretty good. Guys, this thing looks absolutely killer. Absolutely killer. I'm very, very happy with it. So, we're gonna cut the mufflers. So what I'm gonna do today is we're gonna do some sound notes in car, out of the car, if, oh, if not Alex's car. Don't ruin it, Alex is gonna turn on his car. Whoa. There it is, there it is, as you guys see. It's a quad tip. Mm -hmm. 
guys, it's your boy Alex. We're about to install some new parts of the 10th gen. Oh, what are we installing? Type R steering wheel, What's buddy. up? Damn, that looks good, son. Shit. <laughs> we are working on the 10th gen Honda Civic Si, and finally we're gonna make it louder and faster. Uh, I've been debating on what route to go to, and what we're gonna do is we got a PRL, uh, if you guys can see it down there, PRL downpipe and uh, front pipe. So the car is done. So we put everything back together the same way we basically took it out, just in reverse order. And now I'm gonna get Alexander to turn on the car and we're gonna hear cold start, cause it's pretty cold, so it didn't, I didn't really drive it yet. And then she's gonna rev it a bit so we can hear how the car sounds. second gear pull today's an exciting 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 video I got some authentic wheels for the 2018 Civic SI uh, I'm super excited to show you guys it's one of my dream wheels and I'm happy to have it on there it looks really really good uh, let's show you. I'm just going to cut to the cinematics and you guys are going to check it out. What do you guys think? Y'all, they are so, so sick. Today we're gonna work on the tension. We're installing some cosmetics and we're gonna do type R lookalike side skirts. Right now the fitment is, so we test fitted it, it was pretty good, but there's grooves that this actually goes into. So we got one clip in there and the paint match looks actually really, really good. Uh, let me down, let me, uh, can I speak today, Jesus? Let me down. Let me down. <laughs> Yo, I'm so, <laughs> Yo, I'm really happy with this actually. It looks really, really good. Jesus. Makes the car look super low. But I really like it. We're finally doing something that you guys all have been asking me to do. And once again, before we get into that, we're here with Alex. Alex is helping us out. This is a really, really easy DIY, I would say. And uh, we are chrome deleting the Civic. We're taking away the ugly chrome. Let's do it. I'm so down to try wrapping a car. I've been saying this for years. No, I think, I'm not, I'm not doing that. I think I want to wrap this car. I really do. I like the black, but I want to make the paint last. Oh Lord! The Civic is coming along! So you see how the visors look? They look actually really good. I like the little groove it has. Kind of has some aggressiveness. It looks really aggressive. It goes with the car. Uh, goes with the side skirts, even this little type R spoiler thingamajiggy. Chrome delete looks a lot better. The car was, this thing was asking for it pretty much. So let's get into it. Let me show you the parts and it's quite exciting. What's up? We got some PRL parts. It's been a while, but finally we got it. We've been waiting on these parts. And if you guys can see, it says CAI. So we are doing the Cobra intake. 
and uh, we are gonna have to do the windshield wiper relocate Re no windshield wiper reservoir relocate which goes right there and then we're gonna put the bumper back on and there you go right now we have a prl cobra intake obviously prl down pipe and front pipe and a muffler to lead oh yeah you hear that more oh <laughs> we just entered mexico because we got some cutie goodies to install within the car. Uh, we got the new shift knob, we got a short shifter, not an adapter, we got the whole, whole like the whole short shifter. Oh. So this is the lovely care package I got from Acuity. Holy, this feels, oh man, this feels amazing. We're gonna do a second. install the Hasport 62A motor mount on my 10th gen Civic Si. Great success. I love working on new cars. Check it out. Ready, set. You guys probably know by the title, but go. Cool. What's up? So I finally picked up a PRL intercooler with all the charge pipes and everything there. So we're gonna install this today. You can just tell alone by, that's my dog going crazy because Alexander's home. You can just tell the difference like that. Then if we flip him, I think this core size is thicker as well. Yeah. I'm super excited. We have all the other PRL parts so far. Maybe one day the big turbo, uh, but we're just tackling these bolt-ons, but yeah. Alexander's the tripod, so it might be a little bouncy, but she's trying her best right on. I'm trying. That's it. <laughs> all right, we are entering Mexico as always. Do this in a safe area. Thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed that that was basically almost every mod i've done on the 10 gen civic within a year and a half i'd say roughly in uh in a span of almost 20 minutes uh i hope you guys enjoyed it i had to hop on the bandwagon with a video like this it was kind of cool to see the progression of how my car came along as long with how my editing and the color correcting and how the <laughs> excuse me how the videos came along too uh but yeah thank you so much for watching Peace out. Do it once, do it right. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Later.